Debbie Lloyd is a, a nurse. My doctor, Dr. Kipper, had assigned to, to, to oversee the detox and uh, deliver the medications that would help with my uh, the effects of withdrawal that, that, that one goes through so that you don't go through the nastiness of the uh, affair. This after an addict stops using opioids can be painful and severe. You're freezing, but you can't stop sweating and you're just in a pool of sweat. It feels like ants are crawling under your skin, like yeah. food poisoning times 10. It, it, it feels like you're the very inside of you is trying to escape the body. It's physical torture, it's mental torture. You're literally coming undone at the seams. Uh, you're crawling out of your skin. It's basically like you're living in hell. You'd have immense cramps in your stomach. Your muscles would seize. My body would shake. The pain is uh, like nothing I've ever experienced before. It's really, really miserable. And, and we use those analogies like body aches, cramps, diarrhea, nausea, sweats, chills vomiting like just this, this horrible experience right so it's really really unpleasant mm -hmm. and it can last anywhere from three days to weeks unfortunately but with the right medicine we can make that okay opioid use disorder is probably one of the hardest substance use disorders to treat without medication but the easiest to treat with medication without medication and this isn't including those incarcerated there's only about a 10 percent success rate I think it's a more humane way of dealing with people who have a very, very serious problem. Where, where, where did you do this detox process? I'm never comfortable saying this, but it's an island. <laughs> it's a very strange thing to say. Um, but I thought that that would be the best place, the most private, where I can have actual anonymity. Who came with you down to the island for the detox? In fact, initially, my sister Christy uh, was, was going to help Ms. Lloyd and the doctor through the detox, which made perfect sense since the whole thing had been born out of her desire for me to get clean. So initially it was supposed to be Christy in place of Ms. Hurd. There was a there was a great part of me that was very uncomfortable with Ms. Hurd coming along as things could fluctuate very rapidly in our relationship. I, I was I was wary that those things would come up during what needed to be a very straight detoxification of, of, of these substances. But you're fine. I cannot hurt you. I did not punch you. I was hitting you. I'm not sitting here, bitch. Am I? You are. Oh, That's the difference between me and you. You're a baby. Because you start you physical are such fights. A baby. Because you, the f because off, you start physical fights. I did start a physical fight. Yeah, you did. So I had because to fuck Yes. You did. So you did the right thing, the big thing. The, you know what? You're admirable. So then why did Ms. Hurd come down to the island with you during the detox process? She insisted. And she switched places with uh, Christy.